Hi there, Aquarius, and welcome back to Star Lord is Tarot. This is going to be your tarot forecast for the week of October the 1st through to the 7th. I went ahead, shuffle the cards, laid them all out. Let's see what's going on for Aquarius. First up, we have Major Arcana, the Lovers, in the upright position, followed then by the Seven of Swords reversed. And next, we have the Knight of Wands in the upright position, followed by the um, Knight of Cups in the upright. And lastly, we have Major Arcana, the um, Chariot in the upright position. Wow, okay. You have two Major Arcana here in the reading. Could be an intense week for Aquarius. First of all, for your overall energy, Aquarius, you have that of the lovers in the upright position. This is all about uh, needing to make a choice or decision about two situations in your life. Now, um, the, the lover's decision is a little bit more serious than the Two of Swords. This could be a major thing for some of you. It could be a choice decision between two uh, partners. It could be a choice or decision between um, uh, two jobs, uh, two business partners, that kind of energy. So when we're um, talking about this kind of energy, it's very intense and I can already see in this reading Something's going on. Something's up here, Aquarius. <laughs> uh, for uh, your, the beginning of the week, you have the energies of the Seven of Swords in the reverse position. Seven of Swords upright. This can be very avoiding energy. This is when we're trying to avoid perhaps a situation, maybe trying to avoid making a decision, trying to... Uh, avoid a conflict, avoid a person, that kind of thing. Um, it can be a little bit sketchy energy. When it's reversed, however, this is um, no longer avoiding a situation, a person, or a decision. I think you will be coming to a decision at some point this week. Looks like a monumental week from this reading so far. Um, that's how you come into the week, um, making some kind of decision at least to not uh, avoid something any longer. Now you have uh, the next card up is the Knight of Wands in the upright position. Good old pajama man. Um, the Knight of Wands is his court card, so it could be representing a person. If it's representing a person, this is... Um, fire energy, that of uh, Aries, Leo, Sag, Sun, Moon, or Rising, male or female. Now, uh, the Knight of Wands comes in very quickly. He's uh, Quicksilver. This guy rushes in very fast and makes you an offer, and he leaves very quickly if you don't um, you know, take his offer right away. Now, his offer could be anything from a, a job offer to a uh, romantic offer, a, 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 an adventure. He also represents travel. It could be uh, someone coming into uh, wanting to whisk you off on an adventure or a travel. This could even be your travel agent. Maybe some of you are making a decision to uh, take a trip somewhere, but this could be someone definitely coming towards you with some kind of offer that sort of stirs your passion. Now, moving towards the weekend, you have another offer here, Aquarius. This is the Knight of Cups in the upright position. So um, this this is now water energy, that of Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, male or female. Now, this could be representing a separate offer. Maybe you're having an offer for a job situation and you're also getting a, a romantic offer coming in at the same time. Isn't that beautiful? Um, for others of you, this could be representing definitely two suitors because you have the two knights here facing each other and you have the lover's card right in the center. So this could be definitely some of you are making a monumental choice this week uh, and deciding between two suitors. This could be uh, deciding between two job situations where one is very... Um, very dear to your heart and the other one is just like a fast moving offer that comes in wow I see so much change here in your read this week Aquarius wow I think your time has come <laughs> something pretty uh, interesting and pretty monumental is coming your way I think and the last card you have up here is the chariot in the upright position so that's why I think you do end up making a decision this week. Um, the Chariot is all about forward moving energy and it's fast, it's quick. You've got a lot of fast moving stuff going on here with the Knight of Wands as well as the Chariot in this reading. Um, this, th this Chariot card ends your reading here. So this is at the end of the week and this sees you moving towards uh, some type of victory with full confidence. So, wow, what a week, Aquarius. This is incredible. 
uh, you'll have to leave a comment in the comment section below if this uh, resonates for you. Looks like a major, major week. Definitely decisions uh, have to be made and you're no longer putting it off. You're no longer avoiding it. Finally, things are changing. They're moving in the right direction for you guys. I'm happy to see this. I hope this reading helped you, Aquarius. If it did, please feel free to like, share, and subscribe. Otherwise, I'll see you next week. Bye-bye for now.